What is going on, y'all? It is Far Gas here. Hopefully, you're having a great, wonderful day out there in the wasteland. Friends, today we're going to be covering a new wrestling game called AEW Fight Forever. Huge thanks to THQ Nordic for getting us a review copy out super early so we could play and get this coverage out to y'all. Y'all, if you enjoy this type of content, make sure to hit that subscribe button, that bell notification icon, and drop us a like. Let's get in here and talk about if AEW Fight Forever is worth spending your money on. Now, personally for me, I got excited when AEW talked about this game coming out because of the fact that wrestling games are kind of my guilty pleasure games. I think we all have our guilty pleasure games, right? Wrestling games for me take me back to my childhood, and I used to watch a lot of wrestling back in the day. Once the Attitude Era ended, I didn't watch much anymore, but if you've watched some of my live streams, you'll know there's a reason why I say hell yeah to everything. Thing because I'm a huge Stone Cold fan, so you know when a wrestling game comes out, the first thing I do is go into the custom character and see what all can be customized, and y'all, AEW Fight Forever does not slack on this. There is so much that you can customize. It is absolutely amazing. And I can't wait to see what Road to Elite holds in store for Cold Stone. And speaking of Road to Elite, it reminds me of a video game that has nothing to do with wrestling. I don't know if y'all ever played NCAA 14 where you had to go take these play tests and like history tests and quizzes to like, you know, build your character stats up. But in Road to Elite, you can go to the gym, you can go sightseeing, you can go out to dinner. And it's just, it's a good arcadey feel that it's not just you wrestling. The mini games that you can do are a lot of fun as well. Like I said, it feels very arcadey, but in a good way. And this is just kind of nitpicky, so it's not really a negative for the game, but you get a history lesson into AEW while you're playing this video game. And they talked about 10,000 people being in the MGM arena. And if you look past the second row, you really don't see a lot of models. So it doesn't feel as full as you think it should. And whether you're playing Road to Elite or one of the other match types in the game, one of the amazing things that's in this game is daily and weekly challenges. It's so nice to see that the game has a currency and a shop, and if you do these daily challenges or you just play the game in general, you can earn things from the shop. And a breath of fresh air is that I didn't see any way to buy in-game currency, at least yet in the game, but it's one of those things that the shop has so many things that you can acquire just by playing the game and doing challenges honestly it's a breath of fresh air because so many games nowadays put it to where it's a micro transaction inside of a game that you pay full price for one of my favorite match types in this game is the exploding barbed wire death match it's janky the way it works but y'all it's absolutely amazing especially for those of y'all who like to see injuries or blood because you definitely get a shocking good time when you play this match type now the question is do i suggest that you go out and spend $60 to buy this video game. If you're looking for an arcadey wrestling match that you can get in and play for about an hour to three hours and just not even realize it, then yes, I would definitely go out and buy the video game. And if you're an AEW fan, you're definitely going to go out there and get this video game because it has so many stars. The roster list is absolutely huge, y'all. Thanks so much for taking the time out of your busy day to watch this video. And let me know in the comment section below if you'd like to see us review more games in the future y'all have a great and amazing day let me know in the comments section below if you have any questions comments or suggestions y'all thank you so much again for watching this video and i'd love to thank our channel members frugan just jake herb cross blood sebastian nova prophet dreamy houdini zach crm jesse blaze Matas, i go bud cranberry relish gravy train bay i am mr me not you quinn indy andy petty warfy warren blake coma patrick chewy randy nerdy chick diego humdog yegar bond purple nick alex lil squishy super loki shane frogs bp yanko abstractor fire dell that one justin darth stark one low jakey the memes jack luchi mitchell Jay Allen, Daniel Wolf, and POTUS, thank you so much for supporting us out here in the Wasteland. Y'all have a great and wonderful day, and we will catch y'all in the Wasteland later, friends. Peace, y'all.